everyone. So the bird we're going to focus on today is the wren, which is one of my favourite birds. Um, unfortunately I don't have a soft toy to help me today, but what I've done is I've put a picture of the wren in the bottom corner of the video so you know what it looks like if you don't already. Um, so it's one of our smallest birds, um, it's really really tiny, um, it's quite secretive so it's quite a dull brown colour and uh, people often say it's a bit like a mouse the way it moves, it often stays very close to the ground and it likes to go in and amongst your flower pots in the garden looking for insects or if you're out in the woods it might be in the bramble patch keeping very low, so it's very secretive. Um, except when it comes to singing. So when it sings, all secrecy goes out the window because it is so loud, um, especially given how small it is, it is probably the loudest bird you will hear when you're out and about. Um, and I like to think of it as being like a little tiny sergeant major. So what he does is he finds a log or a branch and he'll sit on it and he'll sit really, really straight like this and his tiny little tail will sit up to attention like this and then he'll sing his heart out and it's like a, it's almost like he's shouting in a really high pitched voice and then like he's shouting orders. Um, and then there's like a really loud trill at the end, which sounds almost like a tiny machine gun to be honest. Um, so he's like, he's really loud, he's quite aggressive, um, and he sits up really straight. So if you're out and about and you hear that, um, then it's probably a wren that you're hearing. And what I'll do is I'll put a recording of the wren as well, so you know what I'm talking about on this video at the end. Okay, so I hope that helps you to identify the wren, and I'll see you again soon. Thanks, bye.